what's up y'all i'm here today and i'm gonna teach you guys how to ride an euc that's the abbreviation for electric unicycles you know every time i'm riding somewhere and i go somewhere someone always asks me hey how do you ride that or hey where do you find that but today i'm gonna be telling you guys how to ride an euc an euc it takes balance in the body not only in the lower part of your body but the upper part of your body like your chest and arms everything has to be smooth and in sync with each other in order to stand on an EUC it's gonna take a bit of muscles in your calf lower section you always have to have a calm and smoothness in your body movements it has to you're one with the wheel, so you really have to be in sync with the wheel. To stand on an EUC, you would need to use, for beginners, you would need to stand near something stationary, like a wall or a gate, something you can hold on to to really catch your balance, make sure that it's smooth. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna push your, your body upright, keep it upright, when you're just starting out, it's good to look down at your feet to make sure that your feet is positioned right on the wheel, not too much off the wheel. You want to have you, both of your feet on the wheel. So you might have to spend some time practicing your stance and your footwork on the wheel for a bit. So once you use your most dominant foot and you stand on the wheel, mine is the right foot. So in the video I'm showing, you're going to see my right foot. I used my right foot to stand, to hold the wheel in place and keep it upright. For some people it might be the left. So once you use your most dominant foot, you rest it on the wheel on top of the pedal, forward, you can look down and what you're going to do is you're going to push your body forward, use that stationary object, item, landscape, whatever, and push your body up and once it's up, you're going to put your less dominant foot which could be the left or right, whatever it is, and you're just gonna push your body forward. Do not move the wheel forward because you will fall off, I repeat. Do not push your whole body forward, just push your body upright, and you're gonna stand on it. It might take you a bit to get used to it, but you know, you just keep trying, keep pushing, you'll get there eventually. You know, you really have to build that center core of gravity with the wheel in your body so you're just gonna keep pushing your, your body upright, head straight, and you can look down from time to time to just make sure your footwork is proper. And then you're gonna, and then as you get more comfortable, then you're gonna use that wall and you're gonna push your, yourself forward a little bit. Not too much. You know, if you push your body too far, you will fall off. You know, always have your gear, have your helmet, or wrist, wrist guards, arm guards, knee pads ready, just in case you do fall. And just remember, so if you do fall, do not fall on the wheel. Always jump away from the wheel. You know, like I, I've done some practice with footwork. I've done a lot of that. So that's why I'm able to stand without any gear. So don't bash me about gear. Now, um, after you use that wall or gate, or you can even use a friend, you know, if they're cool with it. And you're pretty much just gonna, you're just pretty much gonna just relax and just transition to move. How I move with the wheel, I usually just push off like a skateboard, a little bit like a skateboard. You kind of use that leg that's on the ground and you push off the ground and then you just put your feet on. And then once you, once you get used to that movement, if you skateboard, you have a faster chance of being able to ride this thing one, one shot, you know? I learned in a few weeks, maybe a few can be a few days. That's my, the purpose of me making this video. So once you learn to push off your dominant leg on the ground, then you would learn how to pretty much ride the wheel. But riding the wheel is another skill in itself. For right now, this is just how to get on an EUC or how to ride to get on, not to maneuver or nothing like that. But maybe in my future videos, like, I'll do that. All right, so I hope from this video, I, I see a lot of a lot more riders out. I hope to see you guys on the road practicing and 
trying as hard as you can and hopefully eventually I see more UC riders on the road. It's my purpose of making this video and to answer a few common ask questions, FAQs from people that I come across outside. Again, thanks for watching this video. If you like what you see, please throw a thumbs up, like and subscribe, show some support, throw some comments in the comments box, start something up. Again, I love you guys. Thanks for watching my videos. See you guys on one of my next videos. Peace. I'm out. Yo, this is how people gonna be riding wheels in 2020. <laughs>